What's going on, everybody? Welcome, welcome, welcome to tonight's call, guys. Super excited to be here. Uh, super excited to uh, trade with a lot of you guys here. I wanted to open up tonight's session uh, for you guys to be able to follow along for completely free. So basically, guys, the way tonight's going to work um, is this is going to be like a real live actual trading session that I normally hold on the Akashics platform, guys. So this is actually uh, a real inside look of what um, a session would be like. I know a lot of you guys are actually coming from um, Akashics as well. So uh, you guys will be able to not only uh, be able to, you know, be on here from that session, but um, you guys, uh, you know, are already kind of used to what we do. So um, if you guys have traded with me before, go ahead, uh, type some dollar signs in the chat, guys. Let me know. I want to make sure I have this. I should have uh, chat open. Okay, cool. Yeah, if you guys have traded with me before, guys, go ahead, type dollar signs in the chat. Um, type, type some fire emojis in the chat. Um, I love to see everybody that's on here, guys. Um, again, super excited. For those of you guys that don't know who I am, my name is Matthew Fair. A lot of people do call me Matty Pips. Um, what I specialize in, guys, is time-based trading. So what I do is I look at the foreign exchange market, um, and basically what I do is I predict which way I believe the market's going to go in a, sp a specific amount of time. Um, this is kind of like an adult version of Simon Says. Um, so basically what I'm going to do tonight, guys, is I'm going to be using some of the tools that are here on the Akashic's uh, platform. And I'm, I'm also going to be basically looking and analyzing the market uh, to make some projections and, and what I believe is going to happen. So um, if you guys have accounts set up, if you guys have demo accounts, real accounts, whatever it is, uh, just make sure that you're trading options. You know, we're not doing long term. We're not holding. We're not doing anything like that, guys. Um, our trades are actually going to be three minutes and three minutes only. So uh, make sure that whoever invited you on this call, guys, they help you get a platform set up or they help you, you know, get an account set up. Um, you know, I'm not going to suggest any specific platforms on tonight's call, guys. Um, you're just going to kind of have to do your own research and figure out which one works best for you. Um, I'm going to kind of keep it simple. Um, I'm going to kind of talk a little bit generically, and I'm going to kind of, you know, base this off of really 
uh, any platform that's really out there. So I'm going to be kind of trading on this screen over here, and then I'm going to be keeping my screen on here uh, using the scanner. So um, I'm going to share my screen, though, guys, real quick. If you guys could for me, just type 111 in the chat. I just want to make sure everybody can hear me. I want to make sure everybody can see me. Um, that way, you know, we can go ahead. We can get started here. Okay, cool. So I'm seeing the ones right now. Let's go. Awesome, awesome, awesome. So guys, uh, basically Akashics um, is a platform here, guys, with My Daily Choice uh, that basically uh, what it uh, does is basically just focus on uh, teaching people how to leverage their money in the markets. So Akashics, guys, is a bunch of different things. You know, it is live sessions. It is, you know, tools to, to basically trade on your own. It is a community, really. It's a community of people that are all teaching, you know, everybody, you know, how to trade. Um, there is a website, guys. You can actually go to akashics.com slash MCT. So akashics.com slash MCT. Um, you guys can actually get to my website here and you guys can actually see exactly what Akashics is first. You know, like I said, we do have an academy. It will teach you, you know, kind of the basics here. Uh, we do, again, have live sessions. We do have trade alerts. So we do actually send trade ideas out to people. Um, the sessions are obviously like you're seeing right now. This is a live session, guys. I'm talking to you. It's kind of like Simon says. Um, again, we do have scanners as well. There is a community chat. So it's not just like you, not just by yourself. You know, if you are a part of any discords or telegrams, you know, things like that, guys, that's kind of what the community chat is. And then what's cool here, guys, is you can actually go out there and you can share this too. Um, and if you just get three people that want to learn to trade as well, yours then becomes free forever. So you actually can get an Akashic's membership, guys, for completely free. Now, today, guys, what we're going to concentrate on is Pulse. So Pulse is a time-based strategy. Um, it does work on a little bit uh, longer timeframes as well. But guys, Pulse, what it really does is it kind of gives you, you know, high probable trade setups. Uh, basically lets you know which way the market should go in a specific amount of time. Uh, Golden Rain is another uh, scanner that we have here, guys, that actually teaches people uh, not, not only how to trade time-based, but also long-term as well. Um, again, we went through the Academy, the live sessions, trade alerts, you know, the app. We do have an app as well that goes on your phone. Um, you know, we have the different reviews and things like that. Um, just, you know, if you are seeing us for the very first time, you can either select the 99, the 199, or the annual, whatever you guys want. Um, but let's just jump into the back office here. So I'm actually going to show you guys real quick. Um, so again, under scanners and then under pulse. If you do have a membership, guys, if you guys are already following along, just go over the pulse scanner here real quick, guys, because this is what we're going to use tonight when we're trading. Oh, look at this, guys. There's already a four-point trade here on CAD CHF. Let's go. Um, we're not going to take it quite yet. We're not going to take it quite yet. I got to kind of go over a couple of different things here uh, to make sure that we're all on the same page. And I want to make sure you guys are following along. I want to make sure you guys are all, you know, understanding what's going on here. Um, I don't want you guys to get confused. And I want to make things very, very simple for you. So, all right, guys, how does this work? What are we trying to accomplish? Well, basically, guys, what we want to do here is we want to utilize this scanner right here, and we want to successfully predict which way we believe the market's going to go in the next, you know, three minutes. So whenever, you know, trades get called out over here on the right-hand side, every five minutes, new ones will come out. So this is actually a brand new trade here, guys. You can see it says sell. You can see it says a score of four. Uh, I like to keep things simple, guys. Three is good, four is great, five is amazing. If you get a four-point trade, guys, that's a great trade. You know, and basically what happens here is you'd want to basically look at CAD CHF. So this is the Canadian dollar versus the Swiss franc. You would want to go over to your platform here, guys. And uh, just to kind of know what to look for here, all platforms are really the same. You know, go look for an options platform, guys. Like I said, whoever invited you on here, they can help you, you know, pick a platform that works best. But uh, you just want to make sure that the correct pair is selected. So right here, you can see USD JPY was selected, but, you know, you would want to do CAD CHF, guys. You would want to make sure you have that pair selected, right? And then what you would want to do is you want to make sure you have three minutes selected, um, and then you would want to make sure that in the trade amount, you're not over leveraging. So a lot of you guys, you know, might be brand new. Some of you guys, you know, maybe you just got started. Maybe you just funded, like, let's say a $500 account. Uh, the most that you would want to put in the trade amount section, guys, would be $25. And the reason for that is because um, you want to make sure that you're using proper risk management. Because proper risk management, guys, will allow you to consistently grow over time. 
If you don't um, use proper risk management or if you don't have any system in place, what's going to happen a lot of times is you're going to over leverage. You're going to trade too much. Sometimes you're going to, you know, basically, I would say gamble, honestly, guys, uh, a little bit too much, right? Because here's the deal. We don't win every single trade that we take, but if we are consistent, right, with our proper risk management, if we're consistent with our rules, if we're consistent with, you know, being patient for the trade, guys, you're going to win more than you lose. And let's just say, guys, you know, you win, let's say three trades and you lose one, right? You should still always profit. But let's say on that one trade, you decided to risk way too much. Like, let's say you won three in a row and you're like, got super confident. You're like, you know what? I'm going to risk way more this time. Well, that one trade, guys, could end up hurting your account. That's what happens to a lot of people when they first get started. So you just want to make sure, again, that you only uh, risk, uh, I would say, 5% max of your account on any given trade. So if you have a $500 account, guys, I wouldn't put anything more there than $25. Um, So if you put $25 there, right, every single time that you press up or down, what you are telling any platform is that you believe in the next three minutes, this price right here, guys, it will be lower than that if you press down. If you press this and you press up, you are saying that it will be higher than that. And that's it, guys. That's really that simple. So on this example right here, like look at this, guys. This was a four-point sell on CAD CHF, right? So if you had CAD CHF selected, if you press the down arrow, right, when this candle opened, now for those of you guys that are completely brand new, you're not going to be able to really understand this so far. But man, if you would have gotten in here, right? If you would have gotten in on this spot right here, right? If you would have opened up CAD CHF, you would have selected three minutes and you would have pressed the down arrow right when it told you, well, on the scanner, guys, green means it went up, red means it went down. Right now, you'd be in profit. And let's see how much time is left right now. Let's go ahead and let's see how much time. Oh my God, you actually would have already cleared. Guys, if you took CAD CHF and you guys cleared, please type some dollar signs in the chat, guys, real quick. If you guys cleared already, if you guys took it, I didn't take it, right? I didn't have time. I'm explaining stuff. But if you guys took CAD CHF already, because only you only had it open for three minutes, you should have actually cleared. If you guys already cleared CAD CHF and you took that trade, guys, go ahead, drop some dollar signs, drop your profits in the chat, tr- type something in the chat, just type something, right? So now new trades just came out, right? Three, 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 three. So these are a bunch of three-point trades. Um, so if I'm gonna take, if I'm gonna look at a three-point trade, I'm probably gonna try to pick, you know, one of my favorite pairs, uh, which it's not on here. So none of these are really my favorite pairs. But let's just look at them real quick. So this is a three-point trade. Um, you know, I, I would say. Yeah, I I don't love this trade. And I'll explain to you guys just in a second why I don't love the trade. But let's look at a couple other ones here. Um, Also don't like that one either. Uh, 3.5. buy. This one's okay. I just don't really like Euro GBP that much. I don't like that trade either. And I don't like that trade either. All right, so I'll explain to you guys real quick why I don't like these trades. Well, one reason why I don't like this trade uh, is because this blue line here, guys, this blue line, it's very kind of faint, you know, if you can't really see it here, but this blue line, right, price right now is above, right, the price is right here, it's above this blue line. So for me, a lot of times that kind of lets me know that price is kind of most likely going to continue up, it's going to kind of be in this uptrend, right, so that's one thing. The second thing that I don't really like, guys, is that this middle band looks like it almost wants to start to kind of cross up it as well. And it kind of already crossed down. And if it crossed down, it was supposed to start a downtrend, but it didn't. So what's most likely going to happen here um, is price is most likely going to uh, go up and continue up. Now, there is a chance this thing might come down, though, to maybe like right here because it does have a red cloud. This is in the sell area. This is in the sell area. You know, right now you would be winning this trade if you did take odd CHF. Um, but again, I just don't love it right now. So I would kind of just stay away. But wow, look at this, guys. $272 was made. Cleared, 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 cleared on the on the before trade. That's awesome. And we haven't even started, guys. We haven't even started the session, but people already made money uh, by just using the scanner so far. So uh, that's what I look for, guys, is I look for really four or five point trades. Um, I really love four or five point trades. Um, those are kind of my favorite trades that I like to take. Um, I also really like to take uh, trades on USDJPY. Ooh, okay. USDJPY is setting up though, guys, for a great trade uh, around the 720. So 147.729 is kind of what I'm looking for here. We have a big green cloud. We have the blue line below. 
Uh, let's check out the currency strength meter too. I like to tech, I like to, to put this into consideration as well. Uh, so if we're looking at USDJPY, this is um, what the currency strength meter, uh, how it works. So if we're looking at USDJPY, if we're thinking that this is going to go up, we want the US dollar, so the USD to be stronger than the Japanese yen if we think price is going to go up. Well, look at this. US dollar, five bars. The Japanese yen, one. Okay, so that's great. That's check number one, right? Green cloud, that's check number two. Now, what I would want to see though, is I'd want to see price kind of come down and touch this middle band, this black line here. Now, this is not a trade call out by pulse. This is just me eyeballing it right now. I would want to see it kind of come down and touch this middle black band. That's what I would want to see. Secondly, I'd want to see this line, this orange line kind of come into the green line, right? Kind of come down a little bit farther. I don't want to see this blue line also come down a little bit farther. When currency moves, these lines move, guys. And they also kind of, you know, represent when there's going to be a reversal, when something's going to happen in the market. Um, so, you know, I just would be a little bit more patient before taking the trade. Um, and I'd also probably want to wait till about 1030. So right now it's 1023. I'd probably want to wait till about 1030 because a lot of times there's a lot of reversals around the half hours or about five minutes after the half hours. So either I'm looking for a four-point trade, a five-point trade, or I'm waiting for either USDJPY, EURUSD, or EURJPY to look like I want them to go to a certain spot, and then I call that out as well. So um, at this very, very given moment right here, guys, I uh, there's nothing that I can take right this second. Nothing that I can take right this second. But um, you know, if we were looking to take a trade, if I believe it's going to go up, I'm going to you know, have you guys select up, call, buy, something along those lines. It's color coded, right? If you look at the scanner, guys, green buy uh, correlates with green up, right? Down, sell, same thing. Again, three minutes, make sure you have three minutes selected. Our goal here, guys, is to basically win two or three trades and be done. Uh, our goal every single night is to try to grow three to 8% of our account every single night. Uh, so $25 is a max risk. And then uh, when your trades are open. So this is kind of the last kind of feature I want to talk about. When your trades are open, guys, um, if they're not in profit. So like, let's say we're predicting that price was going to go up, but price kind of you know went down a little bit. Basically, there is an option for rollover, guys. A lot of these different platforms, they all have rollover. Um, basically, what that does is it just extends your clock a couple more minutes. So it doesn't mean you lost that trade. So even though you predicted that price was going to be either above or below in you know three minutes, if price was lower and there's about a minute left uh, and you were predicting that it was going to go up, you can buy yourself a little bit more time by pressing rollover. And then if you win that trade, guys, you actually make a little bit more money. So uh, if the trade's never... Uh, if, if the trade is ever not in profit, you can always, um, you guys can always, um, you know, roll it over if you need to. Now, this is a four point trade, right? But I don't like it. And here's why. Blue line, right? Blue line is below currency. This middle band looks like it wants to cross up the blue line, right? And there's a green cloud. And let's just look at the currency strength meter real quick. If the Great Britain pound is stronger than the CHF, most likely I'm not going to want to take that either. Look at that. Great Britain pound has actually six bars and the CHF is only two. So yeah, I definitely am not going to take that trade because most likely this is going to continue up. So if you guys are using the Pulse scanner, guys, there it is a great scanner, right? You know, you can just take four and five point trades, but if you just implement just a couple things that I teach on all of my sessions, you're going to do so much better because this is really the difference between losing a four and five point trade and then winning all of your almost four and five point trades. Because right here, if you look at this down arrow, right, that means that we're going to predict that price is going to go down. Well, if we believe price is going to go down, what do we want to see? We want to see a red cloud. We want to see this in the sell area, sell area, sell area, which it is. These are all in the sell area. So that's good. But we would also want to see that the CHF was stronger than the Great Britain pound, which it's not. Uh, right now, uh, the Great Britain pound is actually stronger than the CHF. So <laughs> I'm going to stay away from that one. Uh, Euro GBP, that was seven minutes ago. So we're not going to take that one either. Let's actually uh, go back to USD JPY and check this out again. Um, so yeah, this thing went up, guys. I thought it was going to go up, right? I wanted to see it come down to this middle band. Um, didn't quite go there, but look at that, guys. This thing did work up. I was anticipating that this one, this thing was going to go back up. Um, so that one is a no-go as well right now. Sometimes we take trades right away. Sometimes we are literally just like in the bag, done within you know 20 minutes. Sometimes it takes a little bit. Sometimes it takes a little bit for the market to kind of come to us um, and then you know uh, be able to take a trade. Right now, the euro 
is stronger than the US dollar. So if I'm looking at Euro USD, I want to probably predict that this is going to go up, but I don't like that it's a red cloud. If the red cloud, that's kind of an indication that price is most likely going to go down. Uh, but there is a blue line below. It's right here at the middle band. I don't really like that either. So this is kind of a wash here. So I don't like that entry. And that CAD CHF trade was a perfect trade, you know, right? And and obviously, if you guys took it, you guys won it. Um, but that was really the only clean trade right this second. Euro JPY, nothing. So there's nothing on Euro JPY as well. Again, GBP CHF, like I said, don't really want to take that just because of the way that it's set up. So we got to just kind of wait. Now, let me just go over this real quick. I'm going to pull up, um, I'm going to pull up uh, the scanner over here real quick. Now, it doesn't mean that you get a four point trade and you take the down arrow and if there's other things that aren't going in the right direction, that doesn't mean that you're going to lose it. You know, even though I'm pointing out that I believe that this is going to continue up, um, that's not the end all be all. Like that does not mean that, you know, those are definitely not going to win, um, you know, because they definitely can. They, you definitely can still win, um, even if there's other things that are saying that it's not, um, you can still win those trades. But um Wow, someone someone cleared it. Let's go. Uh, Ron, my favorite pairs are USDJPY, EURUSD, and then EURJPY. So those are my three favorite pairs. So guys, this is what we're basically trying to do here. All right. So let's just say, for instance, you know, you just got started, you got $500 in your account. Our goal is to help you grow that on average, just 3% a session, four days a week, guys, for the rest of the year, uh, for basically 12 months. That'd be 208 sessions. You know, realistically, um, you know, this is this is kind of like over promising, right? Um, and I don't want to over promise and under deliver. So this would be like a perfect world, right? You could grow your account from $500 to 233,000. Right? That's crazy. Like that's amazing. You know, if you're a professional and you're really good at this and you're very disciplined and you've been doing it for a while, it, it's possible, but it's still a little bit hard, right? But look what you would have to basically do. The first day, you'd have to grow your account from $500 to 515, right? So 15 bucks is all you would have to make. Well, if we go back to the example here, right, on, a, on, on let's say a brand new account, 25 bucks, well, look at this, $25, right, is going to be a payout of $48.75. Well, the math on that, guys, is $23 on one trade, right? So that's actually enough for your 3%. So really, all you got to do is win one trade, right? One trade to win your basically 3%, which is not a lot to ask, right? And for a lot of people, you could do that. You could call one trade a day and you could win it and be done, right? Or you might call two trades and go one and one, or you might call three trades and, and go two and one. But realistically, guys, if you could just win one trade a day, you could grow your 3%. If you did that, guys, in one year, right, four times a week, you take your account from $500 to $233,000. But let me just give you a real roadmap because a lot of you guys are just completely brand new. So let's just say, right, you grew your $500 account and you only grew 1%, right? Because this happens to a lot of people when they first get started. They have a $500 account, they grow at 1%. I mean, look at this, guys. Look at this. $500 to $3,900. Now, $500 to $3,900, right? This is what it looks like. On day one, you got to make five, five bucks. Five bucks. That's it. Five bucks. Next day, 505, 510, 515. I got a person that uh, was in the chat earlier today, and they're like, oh, I'm just not doing very good. You know, I'm not growing as fast as I thought I would. But then we broke it down. They've been doing this for two months, which two months, uh, 16 sessions a month, 32 sessions, right? 32 sessions. They basically, you know, to be on this path, they would have had to take their $500 account to about 687. They're at over a thousand and they think they're doing bad, right? Over three months, over two months, right? With a $500 account, there's over a thousand. So they've doubled their account in two months, which in the grand scheme of things, they're thinking, oh man, I'm just not doing good enough. But then I broke this down and I was like, look at this. You're actually better though than you would be if you only grew 1% the first year, every single session. You'd go from $500 to $4,000, right? And then let's look at the second year, right? $3,960. And let's just say you got twice as good as you were right now. You got 2% per session. Look at this. Now you drew your account from that $3,960 to $243,000. That's, that's life-changing, guys. $243,000. And let's say, let's just let's just say you you took out you know almost a hundred thousand dollars right and you just you kept one hundred and fifty in there and you know you didn't do as well as you did the the second year so you only grew one point five percent because you got a little bit timid you got a little bit scared but on that third year guys look at this you still took your account from one 
150,000 to 3.3 million. So that's why I ask a lot of people, if it took you three years to go from 500 to a multimillionaire, would it be worth it? If you were consistent, you took your time and you did everything you possibly could to, to really take this thing serious um, and grew conservatively, would it be worth it to you to go become a multimillionaire in three years? <laughs> Always, everybody says, yes, of course, right? So then why do you get discouraged in your first six months that you're just not going you know, that fast? Or at what, what is fast, right? A lot of people don't even know what fast means. They, they, they think that fast is a thousand percent in their account in their first month, right? And that's what, what happens to a lot of people. So uh, what we're trying to do here, guys, is we're just trying to conservatively grow our accounts over time. So uh, let's see here. Let's check out USCJPY again. Uh, it's still not there. Again, I'd like to catch this around this middle band here. Um, it's not quite there yet. Uh, we're going to have new trades coming out in about a minute and 30 seconds. Uh, for those of you guys that are completely brand new, though, um, I'm a part of a company called My Daily Choice. My Daily Choice was funded back in 2014. It's a house of brands. Uh, so basically, it's a company, guys, that has more than just trading. Yes, we're talking about trading. Yes, we're talking about uh, the scanner that we're using here today. But really, guys, My Daily Choice is an opportunity for you guys to really go out there and create a second stream of income. Trading is amazing, guys. Trading is absolutely amazing. I think it's a skill set that everybody needs to learn. But here's the truth of reality. If you have no money to leverage, you're not going to make any money, right? You need money to trade in order to make money. So the amazing thing about My Daily Choice, guys, is this is a platform for you to have an amazing opportunity to make a stream of income. You know, this company, guys, has a, a, a ton of different brands, from the beauty industry, the skincare industry, the, the personal care industry, the CBD, wellness, weight loss, energy, you know, fuel savings, again, trading, and then also guys travel. So, you know, my daily choice, guys, again, is a house of brands. It's a house of brands that, that really gives you access, guys, uh, to really just so much to talk about. Now, the goal here, guys, is to help you guys go out there and pique people's interest. Now, it doesn't matter what they're interested in, guys. What well, our goal here is to help them make money. And the way you can do that, guys, is basically getting started through the Brand Bucks system. The Brand Bucks, guys, what it is, is basically dollar for dollar, you can redeem it for any product that's a part of My Daily Choice. So you can get started for either $1.99 all the way up to $7.99. Uh, whenever you purchase any Brand Bucks, guys, um, it does give you that amount of money in prepaid travel savings as well. So if you do $199, guys, you're actually going to get $200 of travel savings that you can use on flights and hotels and things like that. Um, all the way up to $799, guys, you're going to get $800 in prepaid savings plus all that money that you did you know, do to, to get started. You could use it towards any products that the company offers. Um, and you also get something called check match. Now, check match, guys, is basically pretty simple to understand. Uh, it's basically if I was in your network, like let's just say I was a part of your network and you shared this with me. Well, if you would have shared this with me 11 years ago, guys, and I was within your uh, level of check match, um, I've made millions of dollars in this industry. You could have made anywhere from 5 to 30% on all of the commissions I've made from this opportunity. That's what this company is offering, guys. So for $199, you get one level of check match. At $799, you're getting four levels of check match, guys. Plus, you're getting the prepaid savings. Plus, you can spend all of this money, guys, on whatever you want. If you want to do Akashics, it's $149. If you want to do um, you know, any of the other products, guys, you can use them to, to take yourself or you can do it to go out there and uh, share it with other people. So uh, this company right now, guys, is in the concentration stage. You know, it's not a brand new company, so it's not in the formulation. Uh, this company really, I believe, is about to go hit a massive momentum spike. Uh, so really, this is a perfect time to lock a position, go out there, capture the market share in this industry. And, and really, guys, you could, you could ride this wave of momentum that's going to happen. You could position yourself right now, go out there, spread the word, and uh, capitalize monetary-wise on the momentum that you're going to see through this company. So um, there's a couple of different ways that we get paid, guys, but I'm going to just kind of make this super, super simple. There's immediate income. So when you share it with anybody, you're going to receive an income when you share whatever you want with, this, with, with anybody. Now, it's also leveraged because anybody that you share this with, if they share it with anybody, you also get an income. And then if you have raving fans that love the products, and it's very simple with trading, if people are making money trading, guess what? They're going to pay their membership every single month. So when they renew or when they buy the product over again, you get a residual income. And if you've never heard of residual income, guys, basically it's money that comes in month after month after month after month for the work that you did in the past. So it's very, very simple here, guys. 
residual income. Whenever someone buys something over again, you're going to get paid on it again. And then there's bonuses income. So as your team grows, as the community grows, as you you know make more sales all throughout the world, uh, we do have rank bonuses. We have pools and things like that. But guys, it's very, very simple. You just basically pick where you want to start from 199 to 799 and uh, you guys can get started here. So um, you can share, obviously, the, the side of trading. Um, you can you know share any of the products that you might be passionate about. And look at all these trades, guys. These are all three-point trades. That's why I'm looking over here and I saw them. But look at this. <laughs> Called the three-point trade, right? Said it was going to go down. Well, look what happened. It went down, right? Could have won that trade. Boom. Said it was going to go down. Went down. Could have won that trade, right? GBP, GBP odd. Said it was going to go up. Starting to go up. Could have won that trade. Said it was going to go down. Wow. Went down. Could have won that trade. You're odd. Said it was going to go up. Could have gotten that trade. Could have won. Anybody take any trades with Paul uh, the last five minutes and take some trades in one? Uh, type some more dollar signs in the chat, guys, real quick. Did anybody take any of the trades uh, from Pulse and, um, you know, and, and cleared? Wow, that is crazy. Look at this. Cleared all of them. I'm telling you guys, you know, this is what's so beautiful about this system is once you learn how to use it, you can trade whenever you want. You can trade at any time. You can use the, the, the scanner. Um, I personally haven't even taken one trade yet. So I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to focus here now. I'm going to look for a setup because um, I want to take some trades. <laughs> I want to take some trades here. Um, I want to potentially make, you know, one or two trades here happen. So I'm going to look at the market here and uh, I want to get in on this action. So I'm going to select three minutes. All right, cool. I got my amount set. All right, cool. Now let's look for an entry. Let's see here. Is there anybody still on the Akashics? Um, is anybody in on the live session? Because I know um, some people might be on the live session that didn't get on the Zoom, but if you're not on the Zoom, um, you should be. So, okay, cool. Wow, let's go. Whoever Zoom user is, that is exactly what you want to do. Made my 5%, lowering my risk, still catch trades. Wow. Let's go. I love it. Congratulations, man. Super happy for you. All right, new trades are coming out here, guys, in about 10 seconds. So I'm going to get prepared here, guys. I'm going to look to see if there's any four or five point trades. Um, I'm going to look to take some. Again, what we're looking for is the pair. We're looking for the direction. And then really, realistically, if it's a sell, we want to try to take it at, a, uh, at its highest point. All right. Nope, this is most likely going to work up. Euro CHF. That's an old one. Man, nothing yet, guys. Check out USDJPY. Still nothing on USDJPY either. So nothing yet, guys. I'm going to go ahead. I'm going to post in the chat. Let everybody know we're live too, because I know there was a lot of people that wanted to hop on. Let me see here real quick. So just waiting for some trades here, guys. Um, there's been a few that I've missed, obviously, that uh, were called out, you know, from um, the from the scanner. But um, all right, so I'm gonna just uh, every five minutes, guys, new trades come out. So realistically, just looking for that to happen here. Um, you know, GBP, JPY guys, um, again, this, this did go down. So it looks like today, even though it looks like price should not, you know, um, go the way that it's predicting every single time it's called it out, it's gone the right way, which is crazy. Um, you know, this is another trade that, that could have went if, if we would have taken it, you know, realistically could have gone to almost eight and tonight, eight and already. And I haven't even taken one trade. I've just looked at all the trades that got called out from the scanner and um, it, what's, which is insane is that every single trade that was called out, guys, could have been a win already so far, which is just it's crazy. So, again, you know, I'm being a little bit more pickier than I normally do. Um, you know, normally I'll uh, I'll take some of these trades, but tonight, you know, I just kind of want to I just want to be a little bit more pickier. Let's see. What are the most strong pairs right now? So we got the odd is in the middle. 
US dollar is in the middle. NZD is very strong. The yen is very weak. The Great Britain pound is kind of in the middle as well. The euro is kind of a little bit on the higher side. The Canadian dollar is on the higher side. And the Swiss franc is very, very weak. So, um, you know, Great Britain pound of the Japanese yen. Again, this is predicting that this is going to go down, right? But look at this. The Great Britain pound is a lot stronger than the Japanese yen. So most likely this is going to go up, right? Because we've got the green cloud. we got the, the blue line below. You know, for me, guys, if I'm looking at GBP, JPY right now, I believe that this thing is going to, you know, go up. It's going to skyrocket, right? Even though realistically, you probably could have uh, cleared it. You could have won. I mean, look at this, six and oh, let's go. I love it. Congratulations, man. I'm super excited for you. I got to take a little story of that real quick. Um, real quick. If you've made money already with the scanner tonight, guys, if you guys could, please drop some dollar signs in the chat, type your profits in the chat. If you've made money with the scanner tonight, uh, just go ahead, drop it in the chat real quick, guys, please. So we are live right now. Someone went 6-0 and already. Uh, the scanner has absolutely crushed it. I personally haven't taken any trades yet, but man, the community is eating. They're making some money. Let's go. So Lou made uh, 70 bucks. Let's go. If you guys made money, if you guys could type your profits in the chat, just kind of curious here. Zoom made over $340. Wow. I love it. Let's go. Let's see here. USDJPY. So it never really came down to this middle band, right? That's what I was looking for. I was waiting for it to kind of come to the middle band. I believed that it was going to go up. It did go up, right? Um, you know, but I just wanted to see if it would come down to that, that middle band and it just qu hasn't quite done that yet. Um, someone asked if I'm in Canada. No, I'm not. I'm not in Canada. I'm actually based, uh, out of Minnesota. So just waiting here, guys, got about 30 seconds till new trades are going to call out. I got mine ready here. Just waiting. 19 seconds. You guys having fun? If you guys are having fun or if you guys are awake, go ahead. Uh, type uh, 777 in the chat like you just hit the jackpot, guys. If you're awake, if you're ready to go, uh, go ahead. Type 777 in the chat. Wow, we got 3-0, and 3-0, and cleared. Wow, let's, let's go. So you guys are ready. You guys are ready. You're prepared. I'm prepared. I'm ready to take a trade here. Another, no, that's four minutes ago. Okay, nothing yet. A new trade should be called out. Anything? Uh, so actually, that was a great question. So Tamaj uh, asked a question, is the profits equal to the amount of pips? I know. So what we're doing here, guys, is we are uh, predicting which way we believe the market's going to go um, in a specific amount of time. And we're using options. So in options, guys, here, it's all based on what you risked and then selecting the time that you believe it's going to expire. So the goal here, guys, is to open up a, an option style platform. There's a bunch of different out there. Like an example would be Nadex. Nadex is a U.S. regulated platform here in the United States. You could use that one. Uh, Pocket Option is another great uh, platform that I believe a lot of people have used. And there's a bunch of other ones you guys can use as well. Um, but they, they trade options, basically just meaning that you're predicting it's either going to go up or it's going to go down. The number here is what's very, very important. You want to make sure that you have the right number, um, that you're looking at the right number. And the way you can see the number is when you're looking at Pulse, it'll tell you the number over here, right? It'll tell you over on the right-hand side. But if you hover your mouse over here as well, you can also look for different areas for entries. And all the way over on the right-hand side, um, there, there's numbers over there on the right-hand side. If you hover your mouse, wherever the number is on the right-hand side, that's the number you want to look for. So if you're looking for price to go up, right, you want to take the number that you're looking for and you want to hit the up button, but it's all based on the amount that you risk, the, 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 the way that you believe the market's going to go. Um, and if you win the trade, you win. If you lose the trade, you lose that money, right? But, um, you know, there is an option, again, to buy yourself more time. So even if the trade goes the wrong way, sometimes you're going to use rollover and it's it's for you to be able to, um, you know, just buy yourself just a little bit more time. Look at this, guys. All right. USDJPY around 740, guys, is what I'm looking for. Um, I really want to take a USDJPY trade, guys. That's right at the middle band. So right around, um, so 147.740 is where I'm looking at. 
Um, I never use OTC. So Ron, um, I don't ever use your OTC. I'm only going to use the real market because that's what Pulse is looking for is the real market. Again, I'd like to see this kind of come down a little bit more. I'd like to see this come down a little bit more. I'd like to see this come down a little bit more. But this thing is uh, perfectly positioned. You know, right here at the middle band, again, is what I'm going to look for. Um, you know, we got the dollar stronger than the yen. So that's, you know, that's in our favor, right? Um, got the green cloud, right? We got the, the EMA below, you know, and we, like I said, I'd like to see this in the green before we take it. But if it comes down to this middle band here, guys, at 740, um, I would like to take that for a three minute buy, call, something along those lines. So just waiting for price to kind of come to that. But if people have taken trades on Pulse uh, before, guys, um, if, if you if if you took some of the other trades that were called out already, you could potentially be eight and zero, which is absolutely insane. Could absolutely crush the market today already. So I'm just waiting here. The lowest USDJP went down so far is seven five one. So I'm not going to suggest any platforms, guys. Um, you know, as soon as I suggest a platform, a lot of people think, you know, I'm getting compensated for it or, you know, they're, you know, thinking that I'm, you know, got connections with it and things like that. So I just don't at this point, I don't uh, I don't suggest anything. Um, just do some research, guys. I mean, if you just Google it, there's a billion platforms that you could literally, you know, find. Um, and whoever invited you to, they, they can let you know what platform to use. All right, so 45 seconds left. New trades are going to come out again. So again, just waiting for that. Um, so I, I really only trade for about an hour. I'll, I'll look at the market for an hour. I'll trade for an hour. If I take one trade during that hour, that's about it. If I take two trades during the hour, that's it. You know, if you know I take more than that, that's great. But my goal is to basically grow three to eight percent during that hour. Um, if I lose two trades in a row, I'm also done. So I don't care what's going on in the market, guys. But if I lose two trades in a row, I am done trading. I only take two trades. Um, so if I lose two trades in a row, I'm done trading. So again, didn't quite come down to this middle band, but it's all good. New trades will come out here. Let's see. No signals found. So there was a lot of trades that were called out. Uh, there was a lot of trades that were called out on Pulse uh, throughout this hour, right? A lot of them were three-point trades. There was one four-point trade at the very, very beginning on CAD CHF um, that you know I, I called out. I said to take it. A lot of people did. Um, they did clear it. Um, and I was looking at USDJPY, but you know, nothing really happened quite yet. Um, I only take three-minute trades. So Jimmy, um, I only take three-minute trades. It's all I look for. I'm still waiting uh, for a potential trade here. I'm not going to leave quite yet. I would, I would like to at least take something. I would like to at least take something tonight. Um, you know, I, I rarely ever uh, don't take anything. So let's see here. Um, so, Alan, if you came from my social media, you can actually go to akashics.com slash MCT. Um, you guys can actually use it that way if you want. Um, so, akashics.com, guys, slash MCT if you want to get started. If I invited you, uh, if someone else invited you guys, you can you can go back to the person that invited you. Um, if you guys are interested in obviously doing my daily choice, um, you can also just go to my daily choice slash uh, MCT as well. So my daily choice.com slash MCT. Again, guys, uh, the brand bucks is the way to start. So again, just waiting here, just waiting here for uh, some trades. You know, it was, it was great for some people. I saw some people were like six and oh, some people were like, Let's just see real quick. So there's no trades quite yet, guys. You know, we're going to wait another two minutes and 30 seconds for new trades to come out. 
But um, just real quick, if you guys have taken any trades on Pulse tonight and you guys cleared some trades on tonight's session, please type uh, what your record is. Type what your record is in the chat real quick, but then also type in what your profit was um, on tonight's session so far. Just real quick. I just want to see what the profit was. I want to see what you guys potentially could have made. So Kashi uh, is 2-0. and Let's go. Kashi is 2-0. and Chris is 6-0. and Made over $304. Kashi made $250. Uh, anybody else? Ron is one and zero. He made four percent on his account. Let's freaking go! Uh, who else? Anybody else? Take some trades. Louis Vuitton made went went two and zero. Let's go! People people got some crazy names uh, in the chat. Anybody else? Jesse's three and one. Hey Jesse, how's it going, man? Haven't seen you in a while, but three and one up five percent. Man, I haven't taken one trade, and all these people have, have done absolutely amazing. I am, I am a little bit mad at myself. <laughs> I've been so focused on explaining everything. I wish I'd been able to take some trades, but um, wow, I am so happy for you guys. Way to freaking go! Um, yeah, there's a minute thirty left, guys. A minute thirty left. Let's see if we can. Uh, Potentially get a couple more here before the the night's done, guys. I'm gonna stay on. I want to take a couple trades. You know, I'm I'm gonna I'm gonna take something here at some point. So um, if you guys want to stay on and trade with me, you guys can. Um, I'll stay live until potentially I take a trade or two. So um, my only Instagram guys, if you ever get DM'd by anybody else, it is not me. My only Instagram guys is at Matthew Thayer. So it's my first and last name. That is it, at Matthew Thayer, guys. Just typed it in the chat as well. Um, there is some scammers out there. There is some imposters out there. So again, at Matthew Thayer, guys, is my only Instagram. So uh, make sure to you know do your due diligence. All right, so uh, USDJPY, guys, has came down to like the 750 area quite a bit. Um, I'm feeling a little bit risky. Like I'm feeling just a little bit risky here. Um, you know, if it comes back down to 754, I think I'm going to take it. I, I think I'm just going to take it. There's 20 seconds left here, guys. If I can get it just to come down into this, this, the 750. So right now it's at uh, four, uh, 147.759. If it can kind of come down into the 750s just one more time, I think I'm going to take it. I, I, I want to take it just, just one time here. Um, again, I'm getting a little bit, uh, I'm getting a little bit risky. You guys want to take this one? I would say, you know, don't, uh, don't over leverage here. Um, you know, lower your risk. Um, it might kind of explode here. I'm hoping that potentially it'll kind of come down to, yeah, 750. When come down to 750, that'd be perfect because that's right there at the middle band. Yeah. And this is even down now below in the green, green cloud. We know the dollar stronger. Yeah. So let's see here. Price right now is at 756. Green cloud, EMA is below, middle band. Can it come into the 50s? So it's in the 50s right now, but I, I really wanted to catch it around 56, 54, you know, 50. Uh, I might miss it. Again, I'm, I'm being a little bit riskier here, guys. So um, I'm just kind of you know, being a little bit over patient. It's okay sometimes to be over patient, but, um, you know, sometimes you just got to take the trades. You can always lower your risk, right? And then take a little bit riskier of trades. So let's go. All right. It's at 755. All right. I'll go ahead. I'm going to take a trade here. So I'm in, guys, at the uh, 7756 seven, area. I'll quickly just show you guys uh, my entry real quick. Just log in. I'll show you guys where I got in real quick, just so you guys can see it. So got in here. Look at that. Got in here. Price shot up. Um, like I said, I believed that this was going to go up. I believe USDJPY was going to go on this uptrend. So I don't know if you guys got in on USDJPY. Um, you know, let me know if you guys did. You know, type some dollar signs in the chat, guys. Look at that. Yep, shot up. Anybody take USDJPY, guys? Um, look at this thing. Got in here. Boom. Shot up. Let's go. Euro USD is calling out a buy. 
this is a this is a decent trade, guys, on Euro USD. But again, it's only a three point trade, so um, probably going to take a you know not going to take that one, right? Um, even though it's a three point trade, I do love Euro USD. But look at this, We've got a big red cloud, which is just basically meaning that the US dollar is most likely um, a little bit stronger, uh, which is not. The euro is still just slightly stronger than the US dollar on Euro USD, but USD JPY guys, that thing absolutely flew. It absolutely flew. Um, I was like, I'm gonna be a little bit, a little bit more riskier, but you know, I, I believe that this thing was gonna skyrocket. So if you guys got in on USD JPY, guys, please let me know. If you guys got in on USD JPY, let me know. Let's go, let's go. Uh, if you guys are in profit, type sexy AF in the chat, guys. Type sexy AF. I'm in there right now. Got in right there. Let's go. Prices skyrocketed. Everybody should be in profit, guys. Everybody should be making some money. Let's go. This thing, look at this, guys. Got in way down here. Price is deep in profits. Um, so everybody should be clearing this one. Like I said, this was not called out, you know, by this was not called out by Pulse. This is not one that um, you know, normally would take, but I've been doing this for so long and I kind of know, you know, what to kind of look for. And price just kept coming to the 750, 750, 750, 750, and then boom, you know, big green cloud. You know, this is in the buy zone. There, at some point, this thing's got to skyrocket. So uh, hopefully, you know, um, if you guys, Won this one, type some dollar signs in the chat, type your you know profits in the chat, type cleared in the chat, type whatever in the chat, make some noise in the chat, guys. Um, super excited to see. I just cleared, boom, let's go. Let's go, let's go, let's go. If you guys made money, type, type your profits in the chat, guys. Um, everyone should have just cleared. Let's go, we got 3-0, up 14%. Uh, we got uh, CB went 2-0, let's go, 48 bucks. Let's go, let's go. Jesse cleared. Love it, love it, love it. Awesome, guys. Well, that is, um, you know, basically it. I've been on here for an hour. You know, a lot of people did very, very well. So I'm very, very happy for a lot of you guys. Jesse made 750 bucks. So it's, it's $200, guys, for the, for the basic package, right? $200 for the, for the $200 brand bucks, right? And, you know, we got somebody on here that made 750 bucks. That's more uh, than the middle package. And that's almost the full top package, guys, where you can get $800 uh, worth of, uh, of, of products here with My Daily Choice. So that's absolutely insane. Louie made 200 bucks. Let's go. I love it. Again, guys, if you made money, type your profits in the chat, guys, before we call it, uh, close this call out. But if you guys made money, type it in the chat. Type it in the chat, guys, real quick. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. So uh, before we wrap it up, before we wrap it up one more time, I just want to kind of share this with you guys um, one more time. So if you guys want to get started, it is $199 uh, for the brand bucks. You know, again, that can be spent on Akashics, right? So if you want to spend it on Akashics, you guys can. Um, you will also get $200 of prepaid travel savings, and you also get one level of check match. So if you go out there and you share it with people, and let's say one of the people ends up being someone like me that goes and makes millions of dollars you know, in the coming years, um, you potentially could make 30% on the one level um, of check match from that, right? Now, if you do the $7.99, you have four levels. So you just have a better opportunity to basically go deeper into your network and um, you know potentially re uh, receive check match. So uh, $7.99, guys, basically gives you $800 to spend on brands. So you can use Akashics, you can use the energy drinks, some of the other stuff you guys would want. Plus, you're going to get $800 in travel savings. And then you're also going to save money on all the products. And you're also get deals on dining and shopping. So a uh, ton of value there. Um, like I said, guys, this company is, is right there, guys. Um, you know, this, this company is right here. It's right in the concentration stage, guys. You have a great opportunity to lock a position here with us, ride the momentum of my daily choice and, and really go take over, go take over the world. Um, I appreciate that EMK. I'm glad you were able to hop on. Um, Keegan cleared over $500. Let's go three and oh, I'd love to see it. Sam made 70. Man, I love when you guys are making money. I love when you guys are having fun, but 
Um, you guys have a great night and I will see you guys. Uh, what's today? Tuesday? No, today's Monday. I'll see you guys tomorrow night uh, on my session. So today was amazing. We did a, a, an incredible job uh, trading today. So you guys have a great night. I will see you guys tomorrow and uh, have a great night, guys. Peace out.